Bring you the Bobcats as they'll take it to the hole at the Time Warner Cable Arena. Happy holidays, sports fans. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg. Now let's take a look at the Bulls' opening lineup. The Beast in a shooting guard. Carlos Boozer and Joe Key Noah, they're inside. Rose and Dang on the floor. And for the Bobcats, Jared Dudley out there with Tyrus Thomas. And it's Corey Brewer and May. And it's going to be the Bulls off the tip. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Gavin, I had a chance to speak with the head coach for the Charlotte Bobcats. He wanted to emphasize to his team being aggressive on offense. He knows they aren't going to get an easy basket against this tough defense, and they will have to be aggressive and assertive if they want to put points up on the board today, guys. We'll see how it works. Thank you, Doris. It's really a mindset, Kevin. You want to get into your defensive groove and find a way to stay there for the full game. Charlotte has possession. This is their first chance to take a look at the Bulls this season. The first of four between these teams this season. The rebound by Noah. And so here is Chicago. From deep rows, the shot misses. And Charlotte the other way out. Four games, one team. That's... That's a nice chunk of your schedule. Exact same conference too, Kevin. So anytime you face a conference team, it's even more important and significant that you take them out. Here is Brewer. 11 points for him in that last game against Memphis. And here's Rose. The dump off. And almost gets it to go, so he'll shoot two here. Tough interior defense means not allowing easy battles. Good drop. And the first one drops. And he makes the first, but misses the second. And here's Charlotte. It's a three-point game. They come into this one following the loss to the Grizzlies. One area that was really lacking was their judgment beyond the arc. If you're having a rough day back there from deep, Please, son, just don't, don't keep jacking up three, okay? Let's get it inside every now and then. Averaging 12 points a game. That can happen when you get greedy with those long passes. Thomas with the ball. It's stolen by Rose. Let's it go from the wing. Drew gets the board inside. Well, he can't believe that one didn't fall. Those are usually automatic. Poked away. Here's the beast, and he slams it home. Here's the replay on the strike slam king. Good execution on the break leads to the nice bucket. Here's Thomas. 17 points for him last game against the Grizzlies in Memphis. And so here is Charlotte. Now Brewer, a rebound by Noah. If you're going to leave someone open out there, he'd be the guy. He doesn't have the touch from that spot. Can't hit, and Charlotte the other way now. You know, even though that one didn't fall, it isn't terribly out of his range. He can hit from that far on occasion. They haven't adjusted to the defensive intensity they're facing. And it's resulted in far too many turnovers here. I mean, just in this quarter alone, they've been throwing it all over the gym. The Beast nails the easy jumper. Five points in the game. And Charlotte has possession. Trailing by five. Hey, that's in. For three, Brewer. Defense made the mistake of playing offense, and he drained it from deep. Chicago leading. They are coming into this having an extra win against the Knicks in their last game. Not to say that it wasn't a good team performance, but when you look at the star impact they got, I mean, he makes this team better. They just play better when he's going well. They certainly haven't been very good here in the quarter in regards to protecting the ball, Kevin.
Here's Welch. Chance there to take the lead. Missing. Down low. Lee with it. No points for him. Over Noah. Dudley, no luck. And so here is Chicago. Here's the beast. It's in for three. Got an open look out there in transition and did not hesitate. That's a nice shot. A catch trail by five. Here is Brewer. Boozer picks him up. And here is Dudley. Jacks up the triple. Kept alive. Brewer. Good. He's got five. Nice. Big momentum builders. Those second chance points. Rose passes to Dan. Left side Rose. Here's Boozer. It's good. This time the assist from Rose. Boozer's got his first points of the game. Here's Charlotte. It's a five-point game. Thomas with the ball. Blocked. About seven and a half minutes left in the first. Here's the beast. Hammers it in. Great awareness makes him a dangerous threat every time down the floor. And the Bobcats have it. They trail by seven. May backs down. The shot is off. So the Bulls will take it the other way. Here's the beast. And again, it's the Bulls from deep. They've been dominant at both ends of the floor, so the early lead is no surprise. And now the first time I've called here for the Bobcats. Right, Bobcats fans. 